This is Better.TV, your online source for home, family, life. Well, every tea has its own unique taste, and because of that, some are obviously more popular than others. Paul Rosen is the founder and chief taster of Peromi Tea. He's here to explain why our tea experience could be better using full leaf tea. And you're also here to give me a little tea 101, right? As well, Absolutely. Just to test out my Absolutely. knowledge. Welcome to the show. Thanks Thank for coming. Thank you so much. Tea's not just for when here. you get sick. No, right? it's not, and I really, really... I want to get that I get annoyed people, right? when people say I only drink tea when I'm sick because <laughs> it's such a beautiful beverage. Yeah. But people have been exposed to, mm -hmm. you know, mass market of commodity tea for so long. And Peromi is actually a, it's a, a line of full, is it full leaf or specialty full teas? Full leaf specialty teas okay. were very aromatic and flavorful. Why, what's yeah. the difference between full leaf and the more common teas that people see out there? Well, full leaf tea, you get a, a much more complex cup of tea. Okay. Um, traditional paper tea bags mm -hmm. like the one we have right here. Right. This is the one um, most, we this won't say the brand. Right, but no, <laughs> but most commodity grocery stores have these. Okay. And what you get in here is fannings and Let's dust. Let's take a look at that in the camera here just to see what it looks like. It's, That's you what know, the it's average common tea. Yes, and it's, and it's dust. Okay. So you, you get a quick infusion with it okay. with a minute. Mm -hmm. Is but it more the, expensive for full leaf teas? Is definitely it? is more expensive. Okay. A little bit. But, okay. you know, per cup of tea, it's really not that bad. Right. Um, when people are brewing teas, uh, you know, a lot of people don't think about the kind of water that you're using. You said tap water is bad. Don't use tap water. Most people, I think, use tap they, water. Yeah, I know. It, it You get a funky taste from okay. it. Okay. And it really alters the taste of the tea. It does. Okay. Yes. You so. also mentioned something to me earlier, which was pretty interesting. As far as the, the normal tea bags that most people see out there, it's a staple is used. And staple is used. Uh, metallic. Metallic. You get a metallic flavor. From that little staple, In right? your cup. And okay. you also get a paper bag taste that you might not be aware of. Okay. With um, these traditional. Yeah, let's take a look at these. It Corn has a beautiful sachet. Bags. Yeah, these sachets, they hold full leaf tea mm -hmm. and you taste pure tea and so nothing else. It's it's really about the bag. I mean, it's not just packaging. It's, it has well, these ba these bags are new in the industry okay. and basically they're they're larger, so they allow okay. for the full leaf tea to okay. unfurl and expand. Okay. And the tea expands a little bit slower. You, it's about a, you know, anywhere mm -hmm. from a 2 to a 5 minute brew time. Now, let's do that too. You're going to show yeah, me how to brew absolutely. tea, right? All right. So absolutely. this is this is one so of the So this is it. This is right out of one of these bottles okay. here. Okay. Yeah, put, put that the in sachet there. in the cup. And then we've got some and hot then, water yeah, here we as well. Yeah, we got hot water there. It should the temperature of the water be at with a certain... Green yeah, with green tea, we want to brew it at about 170 to 180 degrees. Okay. And this is because green tea is delicate. Got and it. And if you put boiling water on it, you're going to shock the tea. Oh. And it's going to release the tannins. You could shock yourself, too. It could. You could hot, shock right? yourself, too, as well. <laughs> exactly. And it'll become a bitter cup of tea. Okay. And okay. also, with green tea, you want to remember, brew it for about two to three minutes. I was just going to say, how long? Yeah. Just two to three minutes, that's it? Two to three minutes. Okay, and what do we have on this side here? We have um, full leaf tea out of a bag. If okay. you want to use a pot, very simple. I can do the same thing. Put yeah, water in we, there. we use right. about a, a teaspoon for, for a, a heaping teaspoon for wow. 12 ounces of tea. Okay. This is a 32 ounce pot, so we'll use about three and a half Did teaspoons. I put too much in there, Paul? No, or am I keep, good? Yeah, keep on keep pouring. Going? Yeah, okay. we can fill it up right okay. to the shoulder. It smells really good. It's a really good. combination of Chinese and Indian black teas infused okay. with coconut and almond slices. It's a wonderful tea. I keep stopping. I think I'm going to overfill it, but you said keep on going. Yeah, right? keep on going. Just it won't overfill. Tell us really quickly what the difference is between the these The difference teas we have right now brewed up, we have our Earl Grey Dolce on the okay. side, which you see it's a beautiful, beautiful caramel color. Okay. And then in the middle, a little bit lighter, is our lemon ginger oolong, which is a semi-oxidized tea. Mm -hmm. Over here is an herbal tea. This is our South American okay. yerba mate blend. It's a wonderful tea. It gives right. you a nice burst of energy. I got to try one of these as we go out. I think you I'm going to South America. Do. You want to join me? I would love to if, come with if, you. If people want to get more sign, information, yes, where do they go? Peromi.com. Okay. P A R O M I. Dot com. Dot com. And we're going to enjoy a fresh brew of tea. I appreciate it. Thank you for watching Better.TV. Please email us your thoughts, ideas at Better.TV. Together, we'll make your home, family, and life better.